Tony, not an elite fighter. And uh, you got your big fight, the fight that you wanted. But we know this fight is about the winning and what lays ahead for Tony Bellion. Yeah, and I'm crap. I'm a little fatty. And I'm crap, little fat cruiserweight. So we'll see on the night, won't we? We'll see who's the, uh, the elite athlete, who's great at doing what he does. Just be, while we're talking about, you know, the previous and the past, let's just stop calling them last two fights of his fights. Then they weren't fights, they were exhibitions. That's exactly what they were. They were something that I can't even put into words what they were. I've told you already, I've described them two opponents. One was called the Cobra, he should have been called the Maggot. And one was called the Mori, the first ever YouTube trained boxer. Come on, come on. Let's all get serious here. These were on, well, to be fair, it, it, it's, it's only right that it was on a comedy channel because, you know, it was a comedy what was taking place in that ring. He wouldn't have employed them guys to spar with, and that's a fact. Because if he employed them to spar, he'd have got rid of them even quicker than he got rid of them on the night. So, you know, let's just stop talking about his last two a fight. The last time he was in a fight was five years ago. <coughs> Simple as that. I've done what I've done. While he's gone missing, while he's been partying away in nightclubs for how long, I've been fighting. I've stayed in the gym. I've done what I've wanted to do. I've wanted to be a boxer. The difference between me and him is I want to fight. I enjoy fighting. He hates it. He doesn't like fighting. But he has to fight. He has to fight. Remember that. And someone who's forced to do it, he does not want to be here, doesn't want to do this, doesn't want to entertain me either. But he has to. And he knows why he has to. And that's all that's important. We get in the ring on March the 4th. Write me off. Say what you want about me. But I won't stop. I'll keep coming. I don't fear nothing of him. He's got this thing that I'm scared of him. All them demands, all them stipulations you put in. I want the ring this size. I want the mat in that size. Listen, mate, I'm not going to run from you. So, Shane, I know that's what you believe I'm going to run. I've got all the respect in the world for Shane. Done an amazing job. I've known Shane a long time. Shane will tell you himself. Brilliant trainer. Great fella. His dad, lots of respect for him as well. So, it's not really about... Shane and David, it's about me and David. We're the ones who fight. All these stipulations he's put on, I'm surprised he never asked me to carry him to that seat into the press conference, to be honest, because there's that many demands and stipulations. The ring size, walk into press conference. I need to, you need to be seated when I walk into a press conference. Do you want me to do your hair as well? I, the demands are just unbelievable. Do you know what my demand was? Let me pick my own gloves and get in the ring. Can I wear the shorts I pick as well? I'm surprised he never told me what boots and shorts I can wear. He's unbelievable. The biggest diva boxing has ever seen. I swear to God, I couldn't believe the demands. Let's just get in the ring on fight night and see. Like I say, write me off at your pedal. I'm the little fat cruiserweight who no one thinks can do anything. Well, I've proven everyone wrong so far. First off, I was British class. I won that. Then I was European class. I won that. I'm never going to be a world champion. I'm never going to do this. never going to do that. I've done that. Let's just see how far I can go. One thing's for certain is, if this fight comes down to courage and heart at any point, like Shane says, he believes it's firepower. If it's not, if the firepower goes out of him and the steam goes out of him after four or five rounds, he is in a world of shit. That is the best way of saying it. It's sink or swim. And believe you me, I love it when it gets there. I love a fight, a hard, horrible fight. I love it. He hasn't been in one. In all truth, he hasn't been in a hard dog fight since Paris against John Mark Mormack. That's the only dog fight he's ever survived in his whole life. And if I can get him to that point there again, he will sink 100%. I've said enough. I'm going to leave you to talk about it because you're just full of nonsense. David, over oh, to yeah, you. So I'll take it from here. All right, thanks for that. Um, ah, here we are. It's a... Uh, it's, a, it's an interesting one. I've been, I said, out of the out of the game, out of uh, you know these uh, these big big fights. I've had big fights. The last couple, the opponents weren't known, but they were still big fights. You know, sell out crowd. You know, good numbers on TV, record breaking numbers on TV. But this is the first, you know, big fight that the fans are getting excited about. And uh, in the time that I've been out, you know, I've been sort of watch. I sort of watch uh, social media and uh, watch YouTube, see what's happening on the scene. And all I've noticed is Eddie Hearn, it's the Ed, everything's the Eddie Hearn show, and this fight gives me the opportunity to shut his big mouth. All he does is jump in front of the camera and host. He shouldn't be hosting this, Adam should be hosting this, but he wanted to get out there. And the reason why uh, Tony believes 
this, I've got loads of div diverish demands. We've got a list of things that I want. Okay, ring, gloves, change rooms, blah, bring along a list. And when it came to negotiations, the only thing Eddie, Eddie's put his foot down on and really wanted was that it was Eddie Hearn and Haymaker promotions presents. It was actually the split. No, well, it wasn't the split. The split but was listen, super I'm, I'm pleased to give you the, the, the pay No, 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 no. The, the only thing pay. you put your foot down on was putting your name first. Because now, once again, you're sticking your face out. It's all about the Eddie Hearn show. It's true. I, know, I can't remember your dad, Barry, sticking his face in all of the situations. I no, tried to watch a Katie Taylor interview the other day. Really interested to see how she was her first fight. Really looking forward to it. She starts talking. You barge her out the way. Ah, here we go. Ambles and pears, you know, <laughs> jumping around, clowning around. It's not the Eddie Hearn show. You should be promoting your fighters. A, bo a boxing promoter promotes the fighters. Don't promote themselves. Why, why are you introducing everybody? You know, technically... I'm more of a promoter on this than you are. Hey, you're you know? a joke promoter. No, you no, are. No, listen, listen, listen. Not we'll fights. see. Listen, we'll, we'll, we'll see. Not All you we'll, want we'll is you want some rap. Once market. again, look at you. Who's, who's talking right? now? Who's talking now? Talking who's talking? No, no, no. I'm talking, talking to the press. To I'm talking to the press. Talking and you're the making press. it the Eddie Hearn show. Listen, you're the look one person who you're loves the sound of their own voice more than me. You're making the Eddie Hearn show. It's about hay versus belly. That's it. Why? I'm talking about it. And I'm talking about this is what makes it that much more sweet. To see a look on your face, the same look that you had after Aldi Harrison, your man Aldi Harrison, Aldi Harrison's going to be the heavyweight champion of the world, he's going to beat David Hay, blah, blah, blah. And what happens? You get smashed to pieces. And you got and a payday. I that's got a payday. What, and that's and, all you want. And, and what, what's, I want the payday. Want. You're putting a cruiserweight in the hardest country in the world. I let you talk. I let you, let you talk. I let you talk. No, no, no. I let you talk. But it's about me. You said it's about me and you. No, no, no. That's what I'm talking about. I agree, but it's about me and you. So why can't we talk about each other? Pipe down. Pipe down. Or what? Pipe down. Or what? You'll see on fight night. I don't, even, I don't even need to talk. Everyone knows what's going to happen. Uh, yeah, dude, Honestly, I'm sure knows, you everyone, do. No, that, that's what you believe. About, that's this what fight you is believe. all about how down. Or what? Pipe down. Or what? You'll see on fight or night. What? I, don't even, I don't even need to talk. Everyone knows what's going to happen. Uh, yeah, dude, I'm Honestly, sure everyone knows, you everyone, do. No, that, that's what you believe. About, that's this what fight you is believe. all about how long it's going to take me to put you unconscious. That's it. What are you putting there? It's about me and you, man. Why are you getting all defensive about your promoter, are you? No, it's not about that. He's already hijacked the press conference already. Listen, you turned up and said it's about Listen, if there was a nasty thing about it, shut up. If there was a nasty Hamid or Chris Eubank coming through, Chris Eubank coming through now, it wouldn't happen because Eddie would jump right in front of them and make it the show about them. <laughs> Can you imagine, if the, where's, where's the, the, the Nassim Hamid and, and Chris Eubanks of today? He doesn't allow, the, allow it to flourish because he gets in front of the camera. He makes oh, it about him. You, you it's the Eddie, when's the next Eddie Hearn show? No, it, it used to be, when's the next Nassim Hamid show? When's the next Chris Eubanks show? How now, much, how how much does show? it kill you that I'm promoting this show? How, how much it doesn't does it kill you? It doesn't put you control. It doesn't hurt me. It doesn't hurt me at all. I love, listen, I love it because you're seeing what happens in the promotion. You're seeing the tickets, tickets sold out. You see the pay per numbers. I've never done that before. This is what happens. I would probably be working with Matchroom if your old man was running the show because your old man was a great, great promoter. you know why? You are working with Matchroom because you've got no choice because you need the dough. No, no, no. It's an easy money. That's fighting, a, fight, fighting a cruiserweight. Okay, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Trust me. You need the dough. I'm working with you today to put the look on your face. Don't worry about me. For the look on your face, for look on all of your team's don't face, worry about me. when I destroy don't your boy. And then I'll be coming back. Then I'll be coming back. Then I'll be coming back. After I've taken out this guy, I'm going to come back and take out Joshua and end your business. That's what I'm doing. I'll give you another welcome to another payday. There's going to be no Joshua fight for you. Matchroom's going to be over. There's going to be no Joshua fight for you. Trust me. You're getting There's smashed. no Everybody Joshua fight for you. Listen, you're getting absolutely yes. destroyed. Everyone knows I'm, it. I'm deep sure in your heart, you know it. Deep in my and heart, mate. Rap deep, pen fold, deep in my heart. Trump coach deep in no my heart. Deep in my heart. I understand yeah, you you're fragile. Me. Head of Haymaker Boxing deep to bring out my t-shirts. That was his job. Deep back in at your heart, I know you're That's fragile as they come. You've Running never around. fought That's anyone who fights team. back. Yeah, Do you really the believe them last two clowns you fought were really good? Both of those opponents. guys would have been. I'd smash the pair of them like I'm going to smash it's you. About, Listen, mate, who I'm not going to run. I'm going to get in your fucking face and I'm going to punch you. Then we got a one round place. knockout job then. Do you want to bet? Do you want to bet on that? Do you want to bet on that? Okay, then let's just bet now. My whole piss on this money now, it does not. I do not go in one. My whole money. My whole money. My whole piss. I do not go round in one. And you're not I getting any get money. Not. Listen, the Unless you come with a bat punk, listen. I ain't going listen. in one at all. Listen, you listen. are not, you are, you're stop going to giving yourself, okay, you know if you're, the, out you know if you're this big killer, right? You know if you're this big uh, killer, why did you fight them two clowns? Listen, Why did you fight them? Because nobody else wanted to fight me. They did everything. That's what. You've for the this, money we offered you've all got the Shannon all Briggs the following you, begging you for more money than them two. Why didn't you fight him? Who? Shannon. Because he didn't want to fight if it wasn't on paper. No, no he That's did why. want to fight you. He's been I've begging got, I had a, I had a contract with Shannon Briggs to fight 
and he pulled out of that you situation. You could have fought him instead of fighting the man. No, you've got to you agree to the guys that come over and get in the ring. He didn't want to get in the he ring. He could have fought you instead of you. You don't know what you're talking he's about. He's trying to sue you for, for what? not I've fighting. I've showed you the contract. I've got a contract. I wouldn't sign a contract. He's trying to sue you for not fighting. You don't want to. All you do is watch the internet and try and get your information off that. I don't. I don't. You and your whole team are getting destroyed. Trust me. I know a lot more about you than the international shows. Let's see who's found your hospital bed on March I know a lot more about you than the international shows. Are you going to be there? Are you going to be there, Dave? Both of you two are putting this guy in such a dangerous situation. Don't worry about You're who's there. This guy's I know a lot more about you and your life than you the internet can ever explain. You know oh, I do, trust me. I know a lot more Whatever about you and your life. My life is irrelevant because fight night. I know your life is irrelevant. I know your life is irrelevant. I could go clubbing every single night from now to the fight. I'd well, get do it. smashed out of my do mind it. every night. And I'll still knock you out. You've been doing it for it's eight easy. years. You've been doing it for eight years. That's why you're scared. I could just turn up. I could just turn up. You've been doing it for eight years. That's why you're scared. turn up. Drunk out of your head, and I'll only use with my left hand, and you'll get knocked out. But you're fighting me. Listen, you're I'm fighting me instead of I'm fighting shot. with a heavyweight championship with the world. You know why you're doing it? For the money. Because I'm the money fight. Not you're the money Chandler fight. Place. I'm the money about fight. You're the money fight. I'm a money fight. How many tickets you sold to your last fight? Your last world you, title fight. Me and you, and you are going to sell more than you I can fight anybody else. I can take a dump in the middle of the ring and sell more tickets than you do. How many did you sell in the OT? You were giving them away outside. Listen. You were giving them away outside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You were giving your ticket to outside. That's a fact. And you was out there trying to that's a fact. your way in. That's a fact. Of course Did I was. you so if you sold out the O2 on the last two fights? Yes. Yeah, you liar. You are telling lies. <sighs> you were giving tickets away outside, you liar. Damn right, yes, I was liar. Outside doing that, you me? out and out lie. They were giving tickets away. <sighs> you couldn't sell them, son. You need a dance partner. You're struggling, and you don't want a real Dude, fight. Dude, there don't was want you a lot of options on the table for me. Shannon Briggs, and you chose and me. And this is a fight. And that you chose the fans me. To say. And no, you the chose Shannon me. Briggs fight couldn't happen. And the you Shannon chose me. Like, the Shannon Briggs would happen. You chose me. You're the option. End of situation. We're going down no, it. No. It's to shut you up. You shut Eddie up. Me. Shut Dave up. That's you it. You chose me. Get a load of birds in one stone. You chose me because I make sense. Easy nights work. Oh, I am. You think that. You think that. You no, really do easy, believe easy, that. It's I'm sure it will. Okay, we'll You'll see. Get, I'm coming out we'll there. I'll, I'll, the same way I said before the Audley Harrison okay. fight, the same way I said before yeah. the Jazora fight, I end the fight when I want to end the fight. Will you? We'll see. And I know, and, and I'll end the fight when I want to. If I want to punish you for three or four rounds, I'll do that. Uh, yeah, if I want to okay. take you out in 30 seconds, I'll do that. It's completely and utterly up to me. You're just in there. You've got no say. You're just okay, a okay. chump in the ring. Okay, a little we fat, shall podgy, we shall skinny, see. We sh light pumped up like heavyweight. We shall see. Yeah, we will see. We shall see. You are an absolute joke. I'm and the joke. guys you yeah, picked yeah, to yeah, fight yeah. are jokes. I'm being looked upon as a joke because I'm a You won a away. vacant world title in your hometown. Yeah. When I won my world title, it was on foreign territory, got paid peanuts, and it was against a guy who'd never lost in, against a guy in 10 years. And what? That's how you win a world title. You don't get given it on your home turf. I had to do it the hard way. Are Same you saying thing, John Mark Mormack was unbeaten in 10 years? He'd beaten every guy he'd ever uh, faced in the last stop, 10 stop. years. Just stop, stop. You've just said he'd he beat every fighter he, he fought he in the last been, 10 years. No, stop. He, no, he hadn't. He'd lost in them he 10 lost years. He lost Onibel and, and won exactly. the rematch. So, so he stop. won the rematch. Shh. He beat every guy he faced in the last 10 years. Down. Shush. He'd lost in them 10 years. And he won the rematch. What's your point? So he still lost. He you beat, just said he, he was beaten, unbeaten in 10 he years. He's beaten every beat. He's beaten so every match. So he's not unbeaten oh, this in 10 is, years. This, this is the confidence Once you're going to get. This is the I technicalities. Need, you're going to get your confidence. Oh, Mormick lost any one. Oh, so he wasn't I'm unbeaten. I'm just pointing out the facts that I know. That the fact well, the fact you is you're unbeaten. getting KO'd. The that's the fact. fact. I'm not that's a fact you really the need fact, to get your head around. The fact around. is, the when fact I hit you're, you're going to feel it. You could even, I could try. Listen, I'm not even going to put my hands up for this one. I'm going to stand in front of you with my hands down. You, even if you do hit me, nothing's going to happen. I'm sure it's you not. You powder puff, you punching yourself. chump. The long He's got not nothing. made you dance like you were on Strictly Come Dancing, that boy. That was like 15. It was so what? Your chin, so is your chin got better? 15. Yes, it has. No, it hasn't. Yes, no, it chins has. get better. It's got better. Chin, chins I'll don't improve. Chins don't improve. Okay, keep, keep telling yourself that. That is, that is your, yeah, your, I'm really chins chinny. don't yeah, improve. Yeah, Vladimir hit me on the chin. Yeah, I didn't even put me over. Because you ran like a tart for, for every single round. Of that. He well, didn't he hit, hit me on the chin real flush with little 10 ounce gloves and nothing happened. So, Why do you so, think you could do it and they couldn't? All those guys I'm off the heavyweight yeah, haven't had Because you're going to come at me and you're going to try and knock me out. You was not interested in engaging Vladimir whatsoever. So that's why when they hit me on the chin with clash flush shots, I didn't get knocked down. You're going to engage me. Listen, you're outgunned in every part. So you lost to Vladimir. You lost to Vladimir because of a broken little toe, you, right? I'll outgun you, Dave, you Dave, in every did, department. Did you lose to Vladimir because of a broken toe? Is that correct? You lost to Vladimir. I knocked me out. You was not interested in engaging Vladimir whatsoever. So that's why you're when they hit me on the chin with clash flush shots, I didn't get me. knocked down. You're going to engage me. Listen, so you're outgunned in every you're, department. So you lost to Vladimir. Outgunned you lost in every single You lost to Vladimir because of a broken little toe, right? You, I'll outgun you, you Dave, in every did, department. Did you lose to Vladimir because of a broken toe? Is that correct? You lost to Vladimir because of a broken toe. Is that correct? No. 
Well, that's what you said. I said it stopped. No, me no, stop. That's what you leg. said. That's what I said. I didn't say that's the fucking you, you reason. Got, you, I've never seen a man take a shoe off so <sighs> quick since Cinderella got the shoe put on a I'll foot. I'll fight barefoot again. You can stamp on my Mate, toes after. You I'll fight the, barefoot. You couldn't get the you. boot off quick enough after the fight. You blame the Keep broken toe. Keep looking into the past. You blame. Just you remember blamed, March the fourth. You blame a broken down. toe for the you reason you lost against Klitschko. But then on the other hand, you beat the biggest heavyweight champion ever. With a broken hand. You, yeah, and what? But it, you, you, listen, but, listen, so you beat the, really, the biggest listen, heavyweight champion ever listen, with a broken hand. Up the past, but when you lost leg, the biggest fight of your life, it was because the of. The fact is, you're getting knocked out. So whatever, the, whatever of. happened in my last fight is no, irrelevant. Because no, 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 you're getting knocked out. You're, you're irrelevant. getting knocked out. Destroyed. Your excuses. We'll are, see on the night when you get. We'll see. We'll see on the night. Dave, what are you going to do if I knock you out? Are you going to leave gonna the happen. game? Are you going to run out? No, just tell me what's going to happen if I flatten if I, you. If I lose to you, yes, I'll need to get struck by lightning on the way. Please, to the ring no, just please what, what, what are you going to do? You're going to leave. It's not the even game. a consideration. I what are you going to do, Dave? I won't even fathom. No, that please, what are you going to do? When I knock you out, I want to stop you. I won't fathom that stupid when I, when idea. When you do a silly dance, when I hit you clean on the head, probably on the on the You're not You don't have the technical ability. You don't have the pedigree. You ain't got anything. You fought a bunch of chumps, and that's it. At cross away, who weren't no good. You said your mate was going to beat me. Your nightclub buddy. You said he was going to beat me. But he didn't. And got, that was he it. I, that, he's not me. He's not me. He got smashed. You he said wasn't he was going to beat me. Pardon? I you thought said, he was going to beat you. Yeah. You really thought that clown was going to beat did me. Did you over overperform or did he underperform? The same think, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The same man who never been buzzed off you in hundreds of rounds of sparring. Yeah. Never even buzzed. Yeah. But got bounced. But they were off the they, floor they were eighteen me. ounce gloves I was got wearing. And he had a head on, guard on. Got bounced off the floor. You had by ten me. ounce gloves on. We bounced off the floor. He got absolutely dealt with. So that means you're going to beat me, yeah? No, it doesn't. But exactly. I'm, I'm, sure, once sure once again, I'm just, I'm just pointing out how much you really do know about this game. You are not the best boxer by a stretch of a mile. One thing you are is an amazing athlete. Oh, thank you very much. You're an amazing athlete. Really and nice you've lived on that I've always your wanted whole to know life. how good my athleticism was. You're an amazing great, athlete. Apparently. Quick, powerful. Says the bell end when it, com when it comes to technical boxing, you are it's shite. Side your side technique Bob is Bob versus poor. the bell end. You'll be known for the bell end for the rest of your life. Listen, mate. Now, how you know, much money you get you know for this the fight? Amount of Everyone money. who will come up to you, you know and the say, amount oh, of Mr. money Bellend, this clown nice has blown. You is that guy that got David, I smashed only need, by the haymaker. That's we good, we, good, we good. both come from absolutely yeah. nothing. How the hell have you blown the money you've blown? Because you've earned an absolute blown fortune. What? What you about? Do you know when I look at you, right? Do you know when I look at you? I can't even say it's because of the clothes or the way you're dressed or you're a man. It's because I'm a better boxer look, than you. Because I'm a better boxer than you. Like an absolute bum. That's what you look like. I look across this table, you've got a hairband on. You for, for, for God's sake, man, you've got a hairband on. It's coming off on fight night. A Don't worry about that. And I'll have pretty and little, and 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 have pretty little braids with little elastics in the end a of it as well. Band on, wait, pretty little braids, my little girly braids on the fight jacket. night. I'll be standing David, over your you're limp you're body you're in the middle joke, of the ring. Man, and I'll show I'll, I'll, I'll let you untangle. I'll go back to your change. I'll go to the hospital and let you untangle my hair, let you play with my hair. To make my life and my children's life work, because ultimately that's all I do this for. I only need five. Remember, you need some sort I of standard living off this fight. I only fight. need five. All that, all that money, all uh, that you money you're going to earn for that, just remember, you see you're not really going to be able to enjoy it. All those lovely meals you may be able to get after it. You're not going to have any teeth to chew the meals. All this money David's in, I only need 5% of that money to make me and my ch child's futures win. Well, I'm happy to this, help you and your idiot, family because you weren't coming from anywhere else other than fighting me. He's blown the lot. He's blown the lot. And this is the only reason he's fighting me because he thinks he's going to walk through me in a round and I'm the biggest payday possible for the easy knockover. That's why he's doing it. He could have fought for the heavyweight championship of the world, but he chose the money. He chose the money because he's skint. I offered David Luke. I offered Lucas Brown broke. two million dollars to fight me. Tell you what, I was going to pay that, David, because it I wasn't was gonna you. Pay that. you I was going to pay that. You I was going to. I was going to pay him two million dollars to fight me. Yes, I was. I was going to pay him two million dollars. Him, ask his promoter, ask his manager, ask Rehan, two million dollars to pay. I was going to pay him to fight me. Yeah, I'm sure he said no. He turned. He turned that, that down. Your mates, that pay, down. your mates were going to pay that, not you. you. I'm telling you a fact. Lucas Brown was going to get two million. I was going to pay Lucas Brown two million dollars. You told me another gonna, fact a minute ago that John Mark Mormack was unbeaten for 10 years. You've had your waffle, you had your little waffle yeah, time. Okay. Let me tell you. Let me like tell you John Mark Mormack was unbeaten for 10 years. Uh, I'm listen, just saying, I'm just anyway, saying what you said. Talking about I could have had a world title fight. No, I couldn't yeah. because Lucas Brown turned down $2 million. He said fight anybody else, uh, Joshua, Klitschko, but you wouldn't fight me. Is that because I'm, I've got to wear hairbands, I'm side Bob? No, it's because he knew I'm the hardest puncher in the division. He would get knocked out pretty quick. I, 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 to be honest, I agree. Yeah, just ask, you know, listen, I'm just saying, you're saying, listen, those world title fights, you know, they will happen and they will happen when I want them to happen. And at the moment, I want to shut your mouth because the fans coming up to me in the street, knocked this guy out, knocked out. I tried to do Shannon Briggs. He didn't want to do it. No, he didn't. So that's it. 
I do know, you know, I've, got con- I've got a contract to say exactly what's what, so I know it. You, all what you know I, is what are sitting up there in, in, in Liverpool chain. I, the only crap. analysis I agree with you on is yes, you, don't you are know the most what you're dangerous heavyweight in the world. Well, you don't know that. You don't I know, know that. I know this game you don't inside know that. out. There's nothing in Clearly possible. you don't, I, otherwise I, you wouldn't be getting in the ring. I have forgot more than you know about this game. I have forgotten. I've been studying Listen, this game. When you was had your first you pro fight, I was already game. world champion. I if was world you champion. Was, yeah, yeah, and, 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 you, and you were still a freaking snot nose amateur. You didn't have a yeah. clue what you were doing. Fighting I'm sure, guys, yeah. 0 and 3. Yeah. Yeah, great, great. You know that, what the that's how much about more is? you know to me about boxing. I, I know a lot more about yeah, it. And yeah, you know yeah, what the yeah. worst Just thing is, David? I enjoy being in it. Have a look his opponents. Have a look at my opponents. And you'll see what's I happening. enjoy being simple. in the game. I'm not the guy who's stuck in a jungle saying, in five years' time, I don't want to be known as a boxer. I want to be known as an established Hollywood actor. I'm, and I I'm will the be. guy who loves boxing. Listen, if you I got offered the part to play a won't. complete and utter moronic you won't. You won't be known as a Hollywood actor. scumbag in a movie, and I wouldn't you, play hey, it. But you, they just said, be yourself. Why did you turn up? They just said, be yourself. Why did you, you turn, turn up, why did you turn up to, to the premiere that I was invited? I was invited there. I was invited. You're the gag. You turned up every bloody chance. I was invited. You turned up Just like I was invited well. to go and see my Usain Bolt uh, thing yesterday. No, you I was invited to come and see your thing because they know when I go there, David, they're going to get pressed. No, That's no, what why. happens is anywhere there's yeah, a camera, listen, listen. you would turn up to the opening of an envelope if there was a camera there. <laughs> you would turn up to the opening of an envelope. You know why? Because you love the cameras. You love fame. You're a nightclub whore. You love nightclubs. That's all you're about. I know how you live your life. I know exactly what you do. Good. You've then you know you're getting drilled and knocked the hell out. That's why. So fantastic. Great. Well, great. It is fantastic because you're going to get a nice under, paycheck under put that. on the end of your hospital bed. And you'll trust go, me, okay, so, the trust me when I say, mate, I'm doing okay. That yeah, movie sure, paid well. Yeah, yeah, we'll see. The we'll movie see. paid well. I'm sure it did. The world title fight paid just well. Just playing a complete moron the movie just paid like well. you the, are. The ta- go, I'm, be yourself. I, I, no, don't learn any lines. I, I, just go and just say some crazy yourself. crap. I'm sure, yeah. Be yourself, yeah, good. That's all Worked with one of the most established actors in Hollywood. Was told by producers... Yeah, to, listen, to listen, come, listen. Come out here and this ain't a movie. This ain't a movie set. Okay, There's no, no director. You, you, no you cut, wish, you no wish you had man. that part. This, Dave, you, you wish you I got wish that I part. had your part. Are you, you wish joking? you got that part in the movie. Are you joking? You said you, I wish I, I was joking. you. Why do I wish I was you, David? Why do because I wish I was you? You'll see that on March the 4th because I'll why, be the winner you? with my hand up. You'll why? be the one getting stretched out of there. How that's why. That's why. And you'll I be thinking, you. I wish I was David now. Walking I away wish there. I was David. You know, that's I why. wish I was David. You would. Yes, you would. March be, the 4th. We'll ask you when you're stretched out. Who would you rather be right now? Tony Bellew unconscious or David Hay walking out there. David's turning up to Tony Bellew's premiere. David Hay's turning up to Tony Bellew's premiere. And I wish I was you. You're turning up to the premieres of the movie I'm in. March 4th, you you'll really, can. really you wish you. I really wish I could everything. punch as fast as David. I'm I wish sure. I really was as elusive as David. But you're not. You're straight up and Dave, down. David, you're not elusive, left, son. Right, yeah, yeah. You're, not elu- you're elusive to these slow heavyweights. You're not Ugh. elusive to cruiserweights. Are yeah, you, so, so in all of honesty, right, are you trying to tell me, guys who pushed you, like Giacobbe Fragamini, who pushed you to the limit, are you trying to tell you them guys are better than me? 2005, man. I'm God just damn. asking. I'm just asking. What? So Giacobbe Fragamini is better than me, David? Yes. No, he's not. How do you know that? No, he's not. He was a European, no, he's he's not. A European so heavyweight I. amateur champion. So am I. And he became a WBC so champion just so like you I. after I knocked him so out. So was I. So and what, so how are you better than him? I'm he, better. He beat, <laughs> anyway, I'm, why am I getting to these trivial arguments? Anyway, I think you've got a point. Guys, guys this guy's you. yappy. You want to see him get knocked out. I'm going to do it. Yeah. Thank you very much, everybody. Yeah. Goddamn. Sure okay.